Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In the previous video, we have draw one example related to the plane scale. In this video also, we will practice some more problem related to the plane scale. So let's start. Construct a plane scale to show kilometer and hectometer. So we have to show two units, kilometer and hectometer. We we know the relationship between kilometer and hectometer. One kilometer is equivalent to 10 hectometer, right? When 25 millimeter is equal to one kilometer. So this is nothing but our RF. Length of drawing is 25 millimeter when actual length is one kilometer and long enough to measure up to 6 km. So this is nothing but maximum distance to be measured. Find RF and so a distance of 4 km and 4 hectometer on the scale. So let's uh, list out the given data first. So RF is equals to length of drawing divided by actual length of object. So length of drawing is 25 mm, actual length of object is 1 km. So let's convert this kilometer into millimeter. So we will get our RF is equivalent to 1 upon 40,000. So this is our RF and maximum distance to be measured is 6 kilometer. Next step is find out the length of scale. So length of scale is equivalent to RF into maximum distance to be measured. So 1 upon 40,000 into 6 kilometer convert this kilometer into millimeter. So we will get our length of scale equivalent to 150 millimeter so this is our length of scale now in next step we will draw a rectangle having length equivalent to 150 millimeter and uh, height is equivalent to 1 centimeter so let's say this is the length of my plane scale 150 millimeter and uh, height is approximately 1 centimeter now Maximum distance to be measured is 6 km. So you have to divide our 150 mm length into 6 part. Right? So let's divide this into 6 part. At the end of first division, let's put 0 over here and right hand side of the 0, our larger unit kilometer, left hand side of the 0, our smaller unit hectometer. So these are the kilometer 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Since our maximum distance to be, to be measured is a 6 km, we have written over here 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. If maximum distance to be measured is a 60 km, in that case we will write it over here 10, 20, 30, 40 and 50. Right? And on the left hand side of the 0, our unit is hectometer. So 1 km is equivalent to 10 hectometer. So logically this length of this division should be equivalent, right? So this is uh, right hand side indicates 1 kilometer, left hand side indicates 10 hectometer, which is equivalent, isn't it? Now we have to divide this into 10 equal parts. Uh, since 150 millimeter we have divided into 6 equal parts, each division of uh, length, each division will be of 25 millimeter, isn't it? So 20, this length is 25 millimeter. We cannot divide 25 millimeter using scale. So we will use that method to divide any length of line into equivalent part. If you haven't watched that video, you can click on this I button. So just uh, uh, draw a line at an angle less than 30 degree and uh, dimension of such a line should be uh, selected in such a way that it can be easily divided into 10 equal parts so this length is 25 so i can take length is equal equivalent to 30 millimeter which can easily divide by 10 equal parts so 3 millimeter each end of this uh, line you can join using the roller scale and after that you can uh, draw a parallel line parallel to this uh, line and passing from all these points so in that way you can or you can divide this line into 10 equal parts i hope you understand how i have divided this line into 10 equal parts after dividing the part uh, let's uh, extend that line so these are my uh, 10, 10 division which represent a hectometer let's give some numbering 2 4 6 8 and 10 right let's uh, write it down the representative fraction below the 
scale so this is my complete scale now on this scale let's represent 4 kilometer and 4 hectometer so uh, kilometer unit is over here 4 is over here so you have to extend one line over here one end line over here and uh, 4 hectometer 4 hectometer is over here extend that uh, one end line over here and represent 4 kilometer and 4 hectometer so i hope you understand the concept how i have uh, constructed this plane scale uh, here is a question for you how to represent 1.2 kilometer on this scale if you know the answer do comment in the comment section and uh, here is a another problem for you this is a practice time for you draw a scale of 1 by 80 to show meters and decimeters and long enough to measure up to 8 meters so 5.9 meter and 34 decimeter if you face any difficulty while preparing the preparing this plane scale problem you can write it in the comment section and uh, uh, do like share and subscribe to my channel for such a more content uh, we'll see you in the next video